Welcome to this video on the sharing options in Articulate Rise. So if you use Articulate Rise to create e-learning courses, then you may need to share your content with other people at times to either show them what you're doing, um, give them a workable course online, or share to collaborate with other team members or other people outside of your team. So if you're in any course, you might see this one if you've looked at any of the other videos. I've got setting up your Outlook calendar and in the top right, on the options at the top there, I've got a share option. So I've got two options in here and I'm just going to explain the reasons why I use these so you understand which might work best for you. These are not review options. You do have a review option there which will create a review file for you that you can then send a link to people and they can send you comments back which is super, super useful to get quick feedback that you can make changes to. And it's a really nice function within Articulate Rise. But share is a little bit different. So the top one, you're going to get a preview link. So you can't make comments in here but what I use this sometimes is to share a, an online version of a course to someone that might just need to have a quick look at it, have a quick run through it, but I can't upload it to a learning management system because maybe they don't have access, they're external to your company or something like that. And you can just create a nice, simple preview link from there. And you can even set a password if you want to make sure that no one gets a hold of that link and um, goes in there and looks at your content who shouldn't. So I sometimes use that as a quick way of getting content out to people without having to use a learning management system. Obviously, remember, it's not recorded if you do that. So it's just more of a learning option for them to do. But you're not going to record it and see who's done what and why and past and all that sort of stuff. And then you've got collaborators at the bottom. So this is where I invite my team members or other people to join me and collaborate or manage this course. So if I see the view collaborators option, you can see there it's just myself as the owner. What I can also do then is I can go in there and add someone new. So I'm just going to stick one of my emails in there. And I can click on the invite. And then if I invite that person, I can change it from a collaborator to a manager. And I can even switch them to be the owner of the course. Now, if they're a collaborator, they can go in and make changes to that course. But they can't send out um, sharing links. They can't invite other collaborators. They can't do things like um, previews and reviews and stuff like that and send all that lot out. Um, I'll need to be a micro learning manager to do that and then like I said if someone's being invited and is collaborating on this course I can also change them to be the owner as well if I need that so some really nice little functions that you can do to collaborate on your courses to change ownership and to share previews of your courses using the share options in Articulate Rise so have a go at those do make the most use of those Please don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know what videos you'd like me to record next.